Oh, good job. Oh, sorry. Sorry. That's a massive smoke screen. Good job. Full power. Oh, bro, what the fuck? Hold on. Tow cable, tow cable, tow cable. Turn it on, you imbecile. Move him. Yeah, we saved him. Come on, we'll keep dragging him into cover. He can detach whenever he wants. Oh no, that's a lot. That's a church one. I'm not pending in front of a church on this. Back it up, back it up, back it up. Maximum angle. Good, 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 good. Yeah, the Churchill is an absolute heavy slugger of a tank. And we're kind of in a medium tank. Hey, Puma, you want to be careful going around that corner, right? I'll come out with you then. I'll try and tank some fire. I mean, I am a tank after all. Hey, got the M10. That's great. Yeah. What's that next to him? Is that another M10? It is. Okay, good, 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 good. Oh no, there's another tank there as well. And the church is still. Suppressing MG fire, not that it would do anything. Reload, reload, reload fire. Oh dear. Yeah, artillery fire still on cooldown. Oops. There we go. I am wiggling the turret now to cause them mild annoyance when they're trying to aim for specific modules. We're dead, but it doesn't matter. I can call in IO2. <laughs> it's okay, Wishy. I don't mind dying in War Thunder off deck. If, if I get like two kills, I'm happy because that means you earned enough points now to spawn in an aircraft. And also, since we're en route, I have like 30 seconds to tell you this. That front window in the left and right, those are fully armored. These side windows are not armored. But, on the left there, that metal plate is armoured. It doesn't look like it, but when the pilot is sitting in his chair, he can't see left because that plate is in the way. So theoretically, when you're flying this plane, you see, you can't see the pilot's head. It's fully armoured. Only at really extreme angles, might, maybe might be able to shoot him. That's theoretically. In general purpose, that armor is pretty good at doing what it does good. Stopping bullets. That's the rocket's done. Now we've got one bomb run coming up. In that corridor there where I died, I'm looking for targets. Where's that Churchill? And my game's lagging. That's not good. That means the drivers are going to crash again. Great. Spiffing. Where's the Churchill? Where's the Churchill? Some. There it is. That's not Churchill. Who the fuck are you? Oh, we took out another vehicle. That's good. Driver's crashed, so now my plane has entered shadow mode. I've now become Shadow the Hedgehog of Aviation. What's this? What's this? What's this? this? Good angle, good angle, good angle. Heck yeah! Oh, ho, ho. crashed into the crane. Nice. That was cinematic as fuck. It's because I entered shadow mode. Entered my edgy teenager phase as a plane. Ow. Nope, 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 nope. Oh no, Hurricane got me in a head on, and I didn't even get to drop my bombs. Oh well, I had a lot of fun. IL 2 overflight him. Oh shit! Fuck off! P 47, P, P 47. Amazing that I didn't start. You look at the P 40 armor, and it's on the nape, back of the neck. I find it funny that I didn't even know the word nape until I watched anime. And for some reason, anime seems to really obsess over like the back of the neck as like a beauty thing. And I just always found that weird that I only learned that word because, you know, subtitles in anime. It so frequently doesn't come up, you just say neck. I am an IO2 and I'm going to try and take out two enemy planes. Yeah, make it though. Mm. Oh, congratulations, he killed himself. Cheers, mate. 
I guess you never know until you try. That is a... Aha. Uh -huh. German... It's practically a flying Scharnhorst. But I think I'm one of the few planes in the game designed to take it out. I'm trying to get away from him now. Do a flip! Yes, I took it off wind. No, Wobble Wind, I mean. Wow, that was really cool. Everything worked out for me there. I just got three kills. You know, I was quite pessimistic, and now I've switched back into optimistic. Okay, cool, he's dead. We now need to ditch 400 kilograms of bombs. Is that a fucking tiger? Or was that. No, it was a Panzer IV J, I think. It just had so much add-on armor, I didn't realize. I literally was just right now an American tanker. I saw a Panzer IV and just thought it was a Tiger. I am flying very slow. Let's flip ourselves around with that tail. SB2, did you take it out? SB2 did. I spotted two enemies I want to try and strafe now. It's uh, the Gepard. No, not Gepard. It's the Panzer Flak... Whatever, it's a 20mm gun. Panzer IV there, not going for that one. It's a low angle of attack, but I'm with the frontal armor. But some of those rounds penned, but they had very low like damage after they penetrated. Wait, why is the gunner opening up? Okay, he wasn't on me then. Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. Get under him, get under him, get under him, get under him. Actually, he might not even recover from that angle. He might not recover from that angle. Ha! Pillock. Engine output, engine output, engine output. It's dropped, it's dropped, it's dropped, it's dropped. Why is it dropped? Did it, what happened? Dropped. Flaps. Hey, that's a soft landing. Come on. Yeah, soft landing. Woo! I hear Stuka down there. I'm just going to go for it. There are not many vehicles I can club in this game, but a Stuka is one of them. Like, this is one vehicle that I can comfortably be like, bro. Uh, hold on. I like your cut, G. I don't know, wing whip. He's lawn darting? Nope, not lawn darting. He. <laughs> bro, what the fuck? This is a 50 cal that I'm firing back at him actually, so this can do quite a bit of damage. And the good thing is now that he's leaking water, he's going to be easy to see. Attack the Attack the yep, he's leaking water now, so that gives me the advantage in stop fight. Ha! Shameful display! Me in an IO-2! Taking out a BF-109. You know, if that guy parachutes out and somehow makes it back to his squadron, he is going to be the laughing stock there. Goes on the panzering him here. Goes on the panzering him. Fuck no! It's that reload. I was waiting for that reload the whole time. Ah, oh, lucky git. Even if he just... If you just dinged off the armor or like hit the engine but not exploded, that would have been great. I could have sworn I saw something over there. And now I've wasted all my energy going for a target that didn't exist. Yes! That's something at least. I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Find the target. Oh, there's the plane. I'll go after him still. In a freaking aisle too. Shame. And now that Yak one's under attack. Scanning for targets, scanning for targets. 
I don't want to be airplane busting. That's not what I'm built for. I'm a tank buster, not a heavy fighter. That wasn't part of my plan. That uh, the ram was not part of my plan. Did he get kill credit? No way. Yes. Some sort of heavy Italian AA, I think. Or is it Swedish? It's very slow firing. Maybe it's the Bofors. Is he looking at me now? I see something. Nice. Let's see if we can bomb this one. I think I dropped too late. Oh, just a smidge too late. Enemy AA up. Hopefully he's tunnel visioned in. Yep, he's tunnel visioned in. Let's go get him. That was getting a bit dicey. Oh no, we're out of cannon rounds. Might as well RTB then, or round is over. We won't make it back to base. All I got are two forward facing machine guns, I think. And that looks pretty heavily armored. Like, if I attack at a high enough angle of attack, yeah, sure, but it's still bullets, not cannons. When that rear gun is opening up, you know you're in bad, bad situation. I see him now. Making a nice big target for myself. Okay. Oh, okay, that was very interesting. The guy got obsessed with using his gunner and forgot to steer out of the way of a mountain. But Iotu Stromovic stayed in service long enough to be able to obtain a NATO code name. Bark, really? It existed even when NATO... Wow, I did not know that. Enemies spotted. Thank you, team for designated the designated grid square. Let's actually hunt that heavy plane. Okay, he hasn't noticed me. Good. I think. Yep, let's go after him. Again, he's a bomber hunter, but we're just a fat plane. Or is it just a bomber variant? Ow. Luckily the light machine gun ammo didn't do too much. Pull out, get some energy back because I feel like we're getting shot at. Get back to our side of the map. Okay, cool. Oh, so we've got to get star points. No, wait, I don't want to get star points. This plane's wide. And like, if I turn sideways, it'll probably start, like, descending really fast. A consequence of carrying so much armor around as a plane is that you just handle so badly. Whoa, they're all lined up down there. So juicy. I'm just going to open fire from here on the Puma. Just one vehicle, but it's something. And now I'm 400 kilos lighter. The enemy plane that was twin engine, I think it's back again. I was going to say gone, but I see it now. It's over there. What is it? It's like a. No HE111. It's dropped a big bomb. Let's look at the kill feed there if we got a kill with the bomb. Yeah, it's a Hanker 111. My bad. I thought it was one of the more agile ones. Which is good because I don't think Hanker 111s have any good rear gunners. Well, if he took that angle wide, he might have been able to outrun me. Like, he's got, what, like 7.7s at best in the rear? Like, look how many bits are already missing from him. You alright there, mate?
I'm going to line up with the light machine gun to save ammo. Now I have to use the light machine guns if I run out of main ammo. Okay, Heinkel 111 down. Some sort of... What is that, duck? Heink HS129, maybe? Just staying low and fast over the battlefield. Is that a duck with a 75? As expected, it's got pretty good armor. I'm just going to set the glide for home. Hey, but I put some damage into one of his engines, maybe. No, I didn't. I'm climbing to slow the plane down, get extra energy, figure out where the targets are. Spoiler target, going in for it. Scrap that, another target. Oh, he died. I think there was one near these rocks. He died. This guy's alive. Yeah, he wasn't worth the bombs. It was a Puma. I could pen that easily. I'm going for another cannon strike on that open top vehicle. Maybe I just use the machine guns. No, 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 cannons don't. Just get the kill. Don't save the ammunition. It's Sweden. Open fire. No, it's a martyr free German. Doesn't matter. Still plenty of cannon rounds. Enemy spotted. Let's help out. Oh, it's a bit of a steep angle here. Flaps. Just enough to scare him. I need to get a better angle. Try again. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's get some cannons into the rear. There we go. If you can fire like cannon shells into the rear and get into that fighting compartment, it's a uh, very easy then. I think that is uh, the German AAA half track. Oh, shoot, shoot, bail, bail, bail. Yep, no, we're dead. Shoot. We'll start off with a bomb strike. What is it? Oh, he died. It was a stroke. Oh, that's a waste. Another martyr free. When will they learn, these Germans, that Panzer Jaegers are not that good? Well, they are, unless you go up against the aircraft. Maybe enemy spotted. Nope, it was just a funny shaped rock. We won, and I even got final blow. 